Hello, welcome to Trial Maze. This is a uh, August and September haul video this time uh, of uh, three boxes I managed to get a hold of. I'll just uh, pan you over to show you. So two 140 size, oh they're all apparently 140 size but they are different sizes. Maybe Ami Ami changed the sizing of their boxes <laughs> in the middle of some reason. Um, this one came back in August and uh, the other two came back in September. Uh, one was early September, one was uh, middle of September. Uh, I think I remember what was in these, um, but these will be uh, have their own individual unboxing videos once I get uh, to them. This is just a haul video to show you guys uh, what I've managed, to, what I've ordered for August and September. Um, so I'll probably do, this should be more common as I uh, get more boxes in, uh, depending on how many boxes I get in one month. If there's only one box, I'll just carry that over to the next month. Um, so then I've got more to do in a haul video rather than just doing one box in a haul run, which doesn't really count as a haul video. Um, so if you can comment, like, and subscribe, um, and uh, comment and especially if you're looking forward to any of the uh, unboxing videos I'll be doing of these figures in the uh, future. So we'll get straight on into the uh, unhauling. Unhauling, yep, unhauling. <laughs> I've emptying these boxes. the August Ami Ami uh, flat that they get in, that they put in every month. So I'm guessing that's the August one, most likely. If I remember correctly, this was each of these I think only has one item, I think. Extremely well packaged. Here's Taiho from uh, Monithos. A bit port scale. So I definitely look good forward to doing that one. Um, yep, and the Intrapid Companion version. Oh, uh, by Mimioi, so not Taiho. Uh, by Mimioi. Um, oh, there's, yeah, Cactus Taiho. Uh, so, yeah, this is looking really good. I've got the uh, life size mouse pad, uh, which is down here, which I will be um, uh, having next to her on display. So, that's one quarter scale done. Nothing else in there. Oh, try to get pushed to the back. Uh, this one I think was the newest box, because it's got a customs charge, uh, import VAT, so again with things in the UK, um, so I think it's the same for majority of European countries as well, um, if the value is, over, the converted value uh, is over in the UK at £135, then the, uh, you have to pay import VAT, or VAT customs ch charge as well. Uh, so there's a custom handling fee and then there's the actual VAT um, on top of that they work out depending on the value of the item. Oops, slightly different this time. The Leo bunny version. Freeing. So that's looking really good. Can't wait to unbox her. Should be a really good looking figure. Nothing else in there. And for the final box, let's just just you. This is a quarter scale as well, if I remember correctly. Oh, 
Oh yep, this is September. September is this one. Two Septembers and one August. I mean, I mean, I don't know whether I should keep those. Maybe put them in like a some sort of fold or something. I don't know what to do here. So I've got the uh, Aqua from Konosuba. Oh, by El Coco, which I know this is uh, really tanked in the pre-owned market. You can get this for less than a thousand yen or about a thousand yen from the three and a bit thousand yen I paid for this one. Um, which is fine for me because I've got um, Mega Bean anyways as well. And I'm quite happy with the price that I paid for her anyways. So I'm pretty much I'm going to be pretty happy with Aqua as well. Um, so she, I'll probably just do her unboxing at the same time as the uh, quarter scale in here. Just to uh, make it so we know what comes, it came from the same box. And this is my Bear Panda, the quarter scale pre painted figure. Um, I don't think they have a name on it. Uh, I can't remember exactly what it is, but this was the first court cheap, cheap quarter scale um, that was released. Um, Bear Panda have got, I think, a couple of other quarter scales. Um, which I'm looking, which I've also pre-ordered. So this is the first one which I'll be reviewing. That was nine thousand nine hundred yen, if I remember correctly. And uh, let me just get these up away. Set these up. So yeah, nine thousand nine hundred yen for a core scale uh, from Bear Panda makes basically it makes her. I think that's the box there. Um. I think, yeah, I think this was 9,000 yen, or was it 8,000 yen? Is this one here? Here we go. 9,900 yen for a quarter scale. So you're looking at, hopefully, well, I'll do a comparison between her and a bunch of my other quarter scales I've got. Um, I've got own like six other quarter scales already, and also got these two quarter scales as well. Um, so we'll be able to compare whether Bear Panda and their quarter scale line that they're coming out with. And there's a couple of other manufacturers as well that are doing cheaper quarter scales that are slower than 20,000 yen. Uh, so sort of, most of them are around 10,000. Um, but this is the first one uh, in the long line of ones that I have pre-ordered. Um, to review for you guys as well. Uh, to see whether the pricing, freeing, or charging are is justified or not. Um, for, I, yeah, so I hopefully I can do a review of this. And actually this one will probably be a bit more, bit more in depth than the other two quarter scale reviews than the other uh, unboxing figures. So this I'll be doing comparisons with this and uh, a couple of other quarter scale figures that I have, um, native and binding figures, um, native and freeing, um, being the two prevalent manufacturers that do quarter scale out there. Uh, obviously uh, Mimioi has started been doing Azure Lane quarter scales for only for the past couple of years as well. So I can do at least compare for some between three uh, manufacturers that do quarter scales. And uh, see how this compares to the uh, other manufacturers that have been out there. Um, that's it for this haul. This is the York from August. So this is my August and September haul. Um, and I'll be uh, chucking this up on the 29th of September. Um, I've got some more, generally, mainly, quarter scales coming uh, uh, that I'll be paying for over the next three, four, three, four months. Um, uh, but they will all be surface parcels. I'm not paying the extortionate pricing uh, to ship them here fast. So uh, this uh, other people, other uh, also YouTubers will, uh, bigger YouTubers will get their videos out faster. Um, but I'm refused to pay that sort of pricing when the money I save on using surface parcels instead, I can put towards paying for the import uh, VAT um, that we have here in the UK. Uh, which is what I'd rather do, um, and I will be. I'm working on uh, shipping costs and uh, how much I pay for the figures, and the uh, import fees as well that I have to pay on top of those figures when I get them in to customs. Um, which I will be doing that probably the end of the year, as I'll have a lot more quarter scales on order then. Uh, obviously, I won't have all of them in hand, as it takes about two to three months. Generally, I've been seeing about ten weeks. Uh, for me to actually see them from shipped uh, from Ami Ami's end, uh, from the shipping email to actually getting um, uh, basically a letter confirming to pay for import tax, import VAT customs, 
Um, and then that again, they, once I've paid that uh, from the letter, then they get delivered to, uh, well, I get them delivered to my work. Um, since I'm at work five days a week, it makes more sense for me to just get them delivered to my work rather than them delivered here when no one's here. Um, you know, Monday to Friday, you know, middle of, all the way up till five, six o'clock. No one's here really from se uh, from seven till six, so it just makes more sense for me to get them delivered to my work. And it's worked out fine for me to get in my figures delivered to my work. And I just chuck the boxes in my car and then I bring them back home. So that's it, and that's uh, those will be some future videos uh, coming up. I've got some other videos I've got to work on as well. Um, before getting around to uh, doing these uh, unboxings, I've got a couple of other unboxings to do. Uh, so if you can comment, if you think uh, and you're looking forward to any of these reviews and unboxing videos coming up in the future, um, and uh, there's a lot more quarter scales to come, uh, as I've really fallen in love with the quarter scale scale um, of the figures overall and whatnot. So um, I have there's definitely a lot more quarter scales that will be up for review in the future. So I shall catch you in another video in a future video and uh, thank you very much and hopefully you uh, look forward to future haul videos uh, although they'll probably be every few months most likely just depending on how many figures I get in on a month by month basis. Okay thank you very much and bye. Thanks.